Okay, this is Freefall. I'm going to be doing another tutorial on the much-needed permission systems. It's been a while. As you can see, I've upgraded my OS to Windows XP, or not XP, Windows 7, 64-bit, th from my XP 32-bit, uh, so yeah, 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 yeah. I also upped the RAM and the uh, graphics card, but <laughs> that's not really needed. You don't really need to know that. So anyways, um, that's why it looks a little bit different. Um, I'm going to be going over the permission systems. Um, I'm going to need your guys' input now. I'm going to give you show you how I have it set up. Now I'm, and then I'm going to want your feedback so I can show you how to set up yours. So um, that way I can show you different um, kind of like uh, groups and how to do it your guys' way. Because I only have an idea on how I want it set up, uh, but my ideas might be totally different than your ideas on how you want it set up, so I please give me your feedback. And if um, enough people want something similar, I'll make it just a quick video on this. This will be like a um, complete different section, so yeah. I should be on more now. Um, if I ever get back to your responses, uh, I'm sorry. It's kind of been a rough month. I've been trying to reinstall my programs, which is a pain in the butt. Um, but I found a way of kind of modifying the registry so I can cheat that. Um, so anyways, uh, let's get to this. Um, I'm going to have you guys go to login under admin. Uh, as you can see, I'm under admin and under uh, uh, default class. So I'm going to go to permission server groups. As you can see, I have two groups already, Registered and NC17. A lot of people have been asking me about Registered. How do I make a Registered group? Well, now I'm going to show you how I would make it. Um, it you can totally disagree with me. I'm going to remove Alpha from both of them. Yes, and yes. Okay, so basically for Registered group, I'm going to show Granted Powers. This is basically what you need. I'll have a description in the... Um, or uh, I'll have a PDF in the description, so you can just look at it. And I'll also have a text file if you don't use PDFs. But it'll be confusing as hell. I'm just telling you now. <laughs> um, so basically, what I have is the basic powers. Um, join, uh, semi-permanent, uh, subscribe. Um, you need these three. You don't need to subscribe under this is under channel access. Um, for group, you want to give them an ID or an icon. I have I use the cool little GMZ icon for members for my community I'm in. Um, you can uh, create your own. It goes in your GFX folder. Um, server group underscore and then a number. I would make this really really big number or if not sure if you can use letters or not. Um, but uh, I'd make it unique so because a lot of people are going to be doing this eventually, and when the servers start downloading, it's going to create some confusion. So um, yeah. Uh, right, as of right now, oh yeah, and as of right now, you have to manually download these and put these in your folders. They don't. The server can't do it automatically yet. The moment it does, I will post a video because I really want the um, icons to do it. As you can see, I have a couple of my own already made. So um, yeah. Under registered, I gave them an I kind of eight. So um, I also gave them some kick powers. I would in ban powers. Um, I gave them max ban time of about ten minutes. I think that's in seconds. Yeah. So um, basically, most of these, um, you can go to description and it tells you what it does. Complain power show ban list, and then I have it under names because that's the error message I get in uh thing when it's wrong. So that's basically how I would do it. Um, all my I think the descriptions are uh, even in ch name. So yeah. Anyways, this is pretty much what I have. Um, I'll have it in the text or you can pause the video. Um, here I'll maximize this so you can see everything. This is what I have for the registered users. Um, this works fairly well. Um, now uh, one thing I'm going to show you is how to do um, an NC17 type channel or a restricted channel where uh, certain people can't join, like the admin channel or NC17. How you do that, uh, go about doing that is open up permissions, go to channel permissions, NC17, type in keyword is join, needed 20. That means you need a join power of 20 to join. Most people have the join power of 0 unless you're an admin which has 75 or your register or NC17 keyword join, uh, channel join power, I'm going to give them power 20. I have show granted selected right now but um, if you don't, you'll have like there all these extra ones. So that gives me a value of 20. So there I can join. Um, and pretty much that's all I have. I gave them an icon of 10. So here I'll add uh, my alpha guy. Um, 
I added his database ID. That's another way of doing it without tokens. It's pretty much easier than tokens, I find. It's right here, database ID, or unique hash. All you have to do is click add, and bam. You don't even have to fuss with the tokens. So there, um, that's pretty much it. I gave them an icon of 10, so there's a cool little NC17 icon. Um, I gave them a, the th three basics and I also um, that you need. And then I also gave them some admin powers to kick. I upped it a little, so they can kick each other, and they can ban, but they can't ban each other. So that's pretty much it. They can delete their own bans, and they can view the ban list. That's pretty much all I have for now. Um, I'm gonna, need, as I said before, you need. I'm gonna want uh, your guys' input um, on how I should set up different uh, groups and that, so you can get your own ideas. Um, I'll have PDFs in the description. I'm setting up a website eventually. I'll get it. It's right now basic form. I'll have a link to it. Um, so that way, um, should be able to set it up. It'll be hopefully up or later this week. I already have the PDF uploaded though so um they should be in the description this has been another tutorial by freefall um i'm looking forward to you guys' comments um and ideas on how i should set this up